Good morning and welcome into episode five of the UDL podcast. Biz. Oh shit, yeah, Biz. Right Whoa. <laughs> episode Biz, pardon me, of the UDL podcast presented by Hedge Better. I'm your commissioner, Troy Costa, joined by the founder of UDL, Schmerta, the MVP of the UDL, Riley Lang. We're live. And our guest today, we have two-time All-Star, one-time finalist, and the 2021 Offensive Player of the Year, JT Bain. Hey, what's going yeah. on, guys? Thanks for having me. How we so, doing? baby, Bucket got us in the building. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> a couple of Offensive Player of the Year nominees right here. Got the Bucket yeah, squad. that was a tight race last year, 100%. <laughs> I feel like you didn't up. know you were going to win it, right? I had no idea. That was Jake could have won that easily. Yeah. Alec, Alec won that Alec led the league in easily. scoring. He could have won that. Langer could have won that Jake easily. was a plunk yeah, guy. Yeah, that was good. Right? Yeah, that Jake, was the plunk guy. That was guy. the tightest race out of all of them, I think. Yeah, I think so, too. Max. What you think about that last tourney? Big tourney Saturday. It was a big tourney. The elements definitely played a factor in everything. Mud and so. wind and everything. But it was a good it was a good, uh, good show out. The rookies coming up big. It's huge for the UDL. Hopefully, like yep. each week, we can get some more new rookies every single Absolutely. week. But um, it was it was a solid tournament. Me and Fabi could have performed a little better, two and two on the day, but two and two still solid. Yeah, it's still solid. But you know, with all the tournaments coming up and all the teams fighting for playoff spots, yeah. you got to you got to place, dude. So we're looking nowhere but up for the next tournament. No, nah, I feel that yeah. you, this is a this is a year where you need points because. Um, like you said, there's so many good teams, dude. I feel like there's gonna be a lot of people getting points, like different teams getting points. It's not gonna be the same teams coming in in the in the um like the top the unless top standings. Unless every you're week. Langer. <laughs> well, yeah, well, I mean, but even like those yeah. same teams from last year getting all the same points, like those teams might not even make it. That's like, what I'm trying like to say. We're talking about Rocco and Mazzilli, they fell short. Yep. You know. Uh, yeah. D Hall and Kearney. They fell short. Um, and those were all me and Jake. Those were all yep, Troy good, and Jake. good teams. Bob and JT. A lot of teams you know that I mean? made a the lot of Alec and Garrett didn't even right. show up. You know, right. Scott and Drew didn't even show up. Fennell and Roach were a team no one was talking you about. You know what I mean? Balled out. Yeah. So I, it, it's going to be good this year. Yeah, I'm I feel like I feel like I love the competition this year. You know who else grabbed a point? Joe and Pat. Those two rookies. I was trying okay. to get boom. They Joe and Pat had a playoff point too. They grabbed fifth place. And I think Rocco and Zill grabbed the That's other big fifth place. Oh, did they? Okay. I think they grabbed one. But yeah, it's going to be tough playoff. It's going to be a grind this season. You, you really got to show you up. Gotta, you got to win. You got to win. Yeah. It doesn't matter how. You got to win. You can show up as much as you want, but like Lang has said, like <laughs> being mediocre win. is not going to cut gotta it. Like, you got to ball. You got to win. You dead ass got to bring your A game this season, man. Yeah, and you got to win. You got to win early in tournaments too. You right. do Fuck not yeah. want to be in that losers bracket mm-hmm. gauntlet. Like that, that long losers ass. bracket last tournament was an absolute gauntlet, was true. Was especially crazy. the bottom half of the bracket too. Right. Because every time you win a game in the losers bracket. You think you're moving on, but then it's teams that lose in the winners bracket just come in and Dude, face you right away. You're like, Damn, it's just another bracket. Grinding the whole time, and they're always good teams. Like I feel like you go to the loser bracket and you're like, "Fuck, this game was hotter than my first game." Like, like, why didn't why, I just why win am I that facing one? these guys? Yeah, like I should have <laughs> won my we first lost game. Too. <laughs> How did you guys lose? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's it's crazy. I love it, bro. I love it. Dude, I got matched up with Nick and Colin first round. That's so tough. Cool. It happens, the champs. It happens. It, yeah, that is happens to the best. Draw. Happens to the best. We played bro. them well too. We had them biz biz, but then they got us With, yeah. two more. I had uh, Rochi and Fennell first round. Have never played against either one of them. And Rochi, a rookie too. That little Kareem shot. He's oh, got you were not ready for the, the dream. Shot. Dude, I don't think anyone he, was. I didn't even watch him practice yeah. or anything. And, and when he's it's in the wind, it comes across the table and it's yeah. hard to track. I'm like. What is going on right here? And see, I was table. I dead ass thought like before the tourney started, I see him hook shot in. I'm like, oh, what are we playing? Die horse? Right. And he's like, he looks at me like, like I'm what? just warming up. <laughs> and then he throws the die again. I'm like, yo, I'm asking people, that's his shot. They're like, yeah. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, I've never seen him play. Yeah. I grew up playing baseball, but I've never seen him play die. Yeah. I was 
He's I mean, good. It, it works. And his defense yeah. is good, too. It's yeah. not just he, offense. He, he, like I said, he played baseball. He was shortstop. Nothing got by him. Yeah, that shit was fun to watch. Locked down. They placed, right? They got some points, they? got didn't they? Third. third place. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> they, got their, they got their money back. Yeah. yeah. They placed well. Man. First place was Nick and Colin, obviously. Second place, Lincoln J. Rich. Third, Fennell and Roach. Fourth was um, Torres and Kevin. Yep. That's another team I lost to. And, and then, then fifth, uh, fifth place was at both two teams at fifth place. It was Joe and Pat, Rocco Zill. Joe and Pat, Rocco Zill, nice. So still still two spots up for grabs right now. Yeah, definitely. Seven and eight seed. We're mm-hmm. all tied for seven and eight seed right now. For sure. For sure, for sure. That's a, zero. That's, so that's how a good does, shit how's to think the, about. How does the points go? What do you get for first, second? So you get 15 for winning. You yep. get 10 for second. You get yep. five for third. You get three for fourth. And, and you get one, one for fifth. Yeah, okay. Which is pretty good when you start adding that shit up. If you get right. a bunch of fucking third places, bro, you're chilling. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you can get a high seed without even winning a yeah. absolute Absolutely. tournament. If you're consistent right. third seed, I mean third, fourth place, right. mm-hmm. you're in there. You're you just scoring, bro. You're just scoring right. and fucking after eight tourneys, you're like, holy that shit, up. I got enough points to be in the top four. Of the league. Right. In other seasons, it might not be as important to be third or fourth place in the tournament. You kind of had to win back then, but now I feel like that can... The playoffs changed right, cool. the game. We didn't, we did, yeah, we didn't have, have an eight. We didn't right. have playoffs. The playoffs changed the fucking game, yo. It did. Mm-hmm. People don't want to swap partners as much. Well, I like exactly. that's why, and that's why I like the All Star game. Yeah, you, you know, right. randomized, dude. It, 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 it's we like, have a you know new, I mean? we have a like, new template. I, I've never. I mean, I've played with other people just shooting the shit, but like tournament wise, I've never played without Jay Rich. So playing with Chazo was different. You know what I mean? Yeah. Now this I don't want It'll be different. I don't want to say it. Because, yeah. like, we're not finalized no, we'll be, yet. We'll throw it but out. To, we'll the All-Star out. game is about to be teams. Yeah, imagine that. Imagine there's two teams. captains, the two leading vote-getters. LeBron will, and will be Steph. The like, look, team LeBron, team Steph. They would draft yeah. their teams. It would still be, I think, within your team, it would be random partners, I think, still. Yeah. yeah. But then you you would gather points as a team. So each win, you would – Okay. Your yeah, team would get a point. It would still Saturday. be kind of a, a standard tournament okay. style, but, just but it would just be a two, team two aspect. So like, okay. And it lets it lets two players in the league to kind of see, like, I like I can draft a better team. It's like, no, I can draft a right. better team. It's right. going to be fire. But, but then again, I feel like the, the captain should pick the teammates. Who plays with each other? Yeah. I think that would be good, too, because <clears throat> you could put – I mean, obviously, <clears throat> uh, you could put, like, obviously – you could put all the good people together, but then it's like, all right, when you get down, you got so not so good people, yeah. or what you know what I mean. So I mean, it wouldn't. <laughs> but if you're out. one of those not so good people, you don't want to be paired with another one. Like you're like, where this is my shot to maybe play with Scott or Langa or Jay Rich. You know what I mean? No, that's true. I feel like randomizing it just makes it fun. No, it definitely no, it definitely does. But yeah, it, it would sure. be nice because like if like you could be like, all right, he's he's really good on offense, he's really good on defense. That's it would be more strategic good trying team. to pair people. You know yeah. I mean? yeah. And I mean, then again, I mean if maybe as if, a team you guys could decide the if, partners. Right. I mean if the if, just putting it in one guy's if hands. Two is people lot. don't work out, they don't work out. That's against your team, you know what I mean? But then again, you're all playing for the team. Right. Exactly. That's why but I feel like it's gonna be to, something fun. to dwell on. It's gonna be fun because say say you even you lose and you don't win the all star tourney. But your team wins the All Star team, right? So you yeah, still feel good about yourself. Right, you know what I'm saying right, because right, right, right. you're a part of your lines and everything. Start rooting right. for your yeah, see, and boom, and then we'll have yeah, we'll have people right. rooting for each other. Yeah, that's gonna be dope. We could figure out a way to yeah. give the winning team something, whether it's money or or merch, right. yeah, or something just to keep them involved. Even when if they lose, they go zero and two. Maybe keeps nice, them on yeah. a nice day. little baby All Star trophy that can get passed around, right? Yeah, yeah. that's true. <laughs> yeah. Yo, yo, yeah. We have to find out who to name the All Star uh, game award after. after. Yeah, the award <laughs> after. But that'd be fire. Hey, let's yeah. pick our uh, let's pick our giveaway winner. Hold for on, that. Before, hold on. Before we go to that, I need go to ahead. I need to know something. What's up? JT, what happened to that white Red Sox jersey? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I need to know where that thing <laughs> is Never currently. Again, <laughs> uh, no, I had hope for that shit. Me, bro. Uh, I was like, dude, that thing's gotta important. be gone. It, it is gone, dude. I wish I could have revived it, dude. That was my best tournament ever. Dude. Me and Fabio rode to the ship and then lost to you guys, but. It was, yeah, there was no coming back for that. I was all over the place. That shit was dude. full of mud, grass. I was one with the ground mud. that game. <laughs> do you remember? I, do you want to talk about that game at all or that series at all? You dude, made your oh, you you cruised man. your way through the winners bracket. Bro, you and Fabi were killing yeah, it all. Yeah, time. We're going off. zero losses till the till the we f- beat, yeah. the finals. I'm sure we beat 
Rocco and D Hall would be Alec and G Baby. Yeah. So we played some what, like really good teams to get there. Yeah. And we had um, we had a lead in each one of our championship games against them, and I'm pretty sure both games went into overtime too. And Thanks. Honestly, we just kind of got outplayed, dude. We they just stopped drop and die. I J Rich made one of the greatest plays yeah, I've, I've ever seen. seen. I had dude, no uh, idea. I thought lost I lost his fucking him. shoe, I was, dude. I, honestly, I was already given the fist pump for a point and everything, and he's like, "I got it." I was like. Yeah, Had to dap him up after that. Yeah, I was going to say, I saw your face. You were so surprised, and you were like, yo, good shit. Crazy. Like, I didn't even think you could uh, do that. And honestly, not even because he's my partner, but, I mean, just for someone to reach around, especially someone like JT, and grab, like... That's an NBA and, screen yeah, fan. Scooped it off the ground. Insane, bro. Like, he scooped it off the insane. ground. Insane. His feet were in the air. He had one shoe one on. One shoe bro. on. Mike Miller. I, finals. I'm on the other side of the table, like, <laughs> what's going on? And he just goes... I'm like, Look I got it. No Look way. I <laughs> Puts the cigarette in his mouth next game and Dude. goes even harder. <laughs> yeah, that might have even been to, the, to um, a game save and play, too. Oh, hell yeah. yeah. Probably. I, I think, think, think about it. Game, that might have been game It could have been too. like uh, six biz, some oh shit God. like that. Yeah, that was that was crazy. that was nuts. So yeah, I don't think you even really lost the game. You weren't feeding them fiefs or anything like that. No, they were just didn't. they just stopped dropping the dice. Yeah, and if the like, games like I said, too. it happens. It, it happened to me last week, uh, two weeks ago. Like, mm-hmm. it, it can go nice. at, at any point in the game. It can go either way. Go I'm, either I'm, way. I'm up six one. It. You know what I mean? They start. They don't drop a single dice. At six one, did you think? Was you know, there even you know a thought I mean? in your mind that you could lose that? It's game? over. Fuck no. <laughs> you know what? I mean? exactly. Fuck no. It's why, over. Why would I ever think about losing? I don't. I, I, I'm down six one. I'm like, I got this. Right. And up six one, your you balls know, are bigger than ever. You're like, you know what's what up, I mean? my boy? Like, yeah, like, like city's said, on my back. Dude, just a turn of switch yeah. bounces could just go their way, and like, just how we played, the wind went there. You yeah. know, and it's just FIFA's went there. You know what I mean? Yeah, you everything. Get a, you it was a movie, bro. You know, I don't even think they can call an ever FIFA yeah. at all. I, I really they're, don't. No, they really FIFA. Don't. Do they? They do. They're, mm-hmm. not one of they're like a middle of the pack FIFA yeah, team. Okay. Not a yeah. FIFA okay. team. They, won I mean, off, they had two it. crazy <laughs> FIFAs last year. Yo, time. they won off of FIFA against Kearney and AJ. Like, like one of their last plays where it was a fucking FIFA. Oh, like, right. for one of that. Yeah, so they always, like, do that shit in, like, clutch games. It's crazy. They... Honestly, should they should have zero rings right now. If you really look at it, their two championships, their last one, they were down six <laughs> four to Kearney and AJ, and yeah. they were pretty down on their dumps at that point. Kearney throws two straight fiefs to go down yep. to tie it up six six, and then they lost yeah. two plays later. Yep, they they just just. Oh like no, I'm not saying. I'm just that, saying like though. they. Oh yeah, they're like, very easily yeah. tilted the a other way. A different a different bounce here or there could mm-hmm. easily change the trajectory of a that, lot. And that's, that's why die. I, that's why I'm not right. even mad. You know, what I mean, like, oh yeah, obviously I wish I won, but I mean, like, dude, if you if like winning like that. I mean, here you go. Yeah. You yeah. earned it. I'll you see, earned it. You earned it. You know what I mean? You earned it. That shit was highlight play after highlight play after yeah. highlight play. Yeah. Both fucking dude, teams. That, dude, that la- those last games for like 20-minute games. The last I one was 30. I was, no, 30. I, I got to the point. I'm like, yo, it's getting yeah. dark. I'm kind of cold. cold. I'm kind of like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like ready to fuck. Did you notice how right yo, now. did you notice how much everyone was fucking screaming too? I, I couldn't even hear you. That's what I'm about to say. You didn't even notice that. Yo, Lang wasn't even looking at That was guys. one of the loudest it, fucking it championship was, games, bro. I think it was. Everybody question. was screaming, "Yo, oh my god, the girls are like, right. "Oh my god." You got Cam talking yeah. shit, like Zill talking it was shit, Shazo talking shit. Blocked out. Yep. I don't I don't hear sides. anything, dude. That bro, was it was crazy. loud as we shit in there. You saw it on the footage though, everyone. Oh yeah, I I heard it on the footage for sure yeah. but in the in like in the moment couldn't even tell you why man that's what i'm saying bro it's such adrenaline rush like it's it's crazy all right it's time what's what's in your what the fuck I is jiggling the, uh, cheese it's <laughs> <laughs> i got the giveaway <laughs> this this first giveaway we got two going on right now this first one is for you guys that follow the podcast when yep. we first dropped our podcast page and then an extra three votes in here if you put it on your story so shout out to those that put it on your yeah, story yeah shout out to everyone that went the extra mile to get the extra vote cause we shit, really, it might be you we really do appreciate when you guys share things on your story mm-hmm. that means a ton because it's it's helping us reach an audience that we don't already have obviously yeah. so it means a ton and honestly when every time you guys do it we get at least yeah. three, four, five followers biz followers so keep doing it please and it definitely doesn't go unnoticed just, yeah the best thing like Troy said it. the best thing about it is like we get to literally be in front of everyone else's followers. Like now we're in front of your followers, we're in front of his followers. You know what I mean? So like right. everyone's seeing it. Every so it's counts. dope. Yeah, bro. 
helps with sound. We want your mom to see it and everything. Right. You, know? yeah. <laughs> you might not, yeah. you might not even realize that some of your followers would be into it. Like some exactly. people that follow you that you don't even right. talk to, and then you post it, they're hitting up the page and they're Facts. joining the league. They're like, "Yo, I know such and such." Like, right. yeah, bro, it's a, it's a small world out there. Yeah, I think that's how Tim Durgan signed up way back in the day. He a couple people he had an affiliation with right. with Scott and Drew, and he mm-hmm. was like, "Yo, like, hey, what's that league guys. you guys are playing?" And, and it's crazy because now when I be trying to think about how I met Tim Durgan, I dead ass lumped him into college. I'm like, oh, I knew that yeah. kid since college. Just I'm like, wait, out. no, I only I met him at the fucking dietary, right. bro. Yeah. Like, I already think that's just my boy. I'm like, yeah, Tim Durgan, yeah. Go ahead and grab him. We're grabbing one? Yep. Okay, guys, this is for the, the podcast no, shit, yeah, right? Yeah, it's for the UDL. I hoodie. dropped one. This is the one with the logo on the sleeve, the so, logo on the front, the logo on the back. This, this hoodie is, a is deluxe. Yes. We don't even like, sell this It's hoodie. three logos. You understand what I'm saying now? I got one. Here we go. Can I get a drum roll? What is? It's taped. Hold on, baby. Ooh, it is Victoria. JT, let's go. You want to break the news of Victoria? Victoria, he's like, let me let me get that a double X. Let's go, dude. All right, so um. UDL uh, winner, Victoria. So shout out Victoria. We know Victoria. You're taking that. (laughs) Victoria puts in all the work. She be at every turning. So thank you. Shout out Victoria. Thanks for. Thank you, Victoria. And I know she shared it on her story as well. So that's probably that extra two or three Mm -hmm. votes that shared it on her story and got her over the top to get that. Victoria is definitely one of our biggest supporters. So thank you, Victoria. Shout out Victoria and uh, JT. Now we're your luck came in. <laughs> now we're gonna go get into something a little bit bigger. We got our hedge better sponsored players of the week for this upcoming tourney. These are Huge. for people. I don't know if you saw our story today, but these are for people who followed the four podcasts and yep. our our friends over here at Hedge Better. If you follow these five accounts and also subscribe to Hedge Better on YouTube, you're automatically entered for good for the rest of the season into the opportunity to win a free tourney. And and not only is it a free tourney, like just think of it as this. You get um, a loan that comes with no damn interest. You don't have to pay the shit back. And you're investing it in yourself in a UDL tournament to flip it into win money. money, a championship, and you get a custom video of yourself probably at the end of the year holding up the belt or some shit. So there's a lot that... And you're gonna get that could happen from going to this yeah. tourney. You know what I mean? All and you it's do is buy some free. beers. <laughs> free 25 bucks. Yeah. You yeah. Can, you can, now your beers are fucking free yeah. because you buy you're some saying? beers and you're good. Yeah, maybe, yeah, maybe being a sponsored player will rub off a little good luck. Who knows? Maybe every week is a sponsored player is winning the tourney. So that shit could turn into turn magic. Into it could be that magical. That's extra motivation. Absolutely. If I got That's what I said. Pull my name. Pull my name. All right. I got a sponsor on my back. I got to play hot. You know what I mean? So. First podcast is the High Slot Podcast. Shout out to the High Slot Shout Podcast. Shout out High Slot. And their sponsored player this week is going to be J-Lar. Oh, Johnny J-Lar. LaRossi. Wow. Johnny LaRossi is the Shout High Slot Lar. Podcast sponsored player of the Shout week. Shout out Lar, baby. Shout out Lar. Congratulations. You won't be paying to play in Saturday's tourney. He's going to love that. He's going to love that. First sponsored More Henny. player. More Henny for J-Lar. <laughs> More Henny for everyone. <laughs> oh, more Henny. Dude, I think. I think. I think he now, went to the dude. store and got more. Listen, more he came. Someone go. He got came more. with a bottle. Went to the store, grabbed yeah. the fucking fifth. Came back. Yeah. Facts. Finished both of them. Faced the first one. This time it's going to be VSOP. <laughs> Next up, we have Mass Appeal podcast. Shout out Shout Tommy out G Appeal. and the boys over at Mass Appeal. Uh, give that a follow if you're not already. The sponsored player of the week for Mass Appeal is Rocco. Whoa. Rocco. Rocco getting Rob. a free tourney. Rob. Robbie. Big Rob. So, Rob, you are the Mass Appeal player of the week. Congratulations. That's, that's big, man. You're putting on for Mass, and you got to be appealing. Next up, uh, we got a big one here. We got the Steel and Naz podcast. Love that podcast. Shout out Steel and Naz. Steel and Naz podcast. One of my favorites. Definitely give them a follow. They are working. Those boys really know what they're doing over there. Mm-hmm. And uh, the Steel and Naz sponsored player of the week is Riley Lang. Wow. Riley oh, Lang. Yeah. Wow. Let's go, Lang. Lang also Let's wins it. everything, too, man. Lang wins Dude. everything. When man. do we not say I'll his put the boys name. on for sure. <laughs> Steel and Naz might have a Lock me up. Might have a turn yeah. coming their way. I love that. Player. I love that partnership right there. I just need their support at the tourney. Mm-hmm. Hint, our, hint. Our, <laughs> final, our final sponsored player of the week is the Scramble Podcast. Shout out to the Scramble Podcast. Go give them a follow. 
the Scramble Podcast Player of the Week. It's a great is podcast for all your golf insights, man. Fantastic golf podcast. Mm-hmm. Ooh, might have to get on that. Nice, nice, bro. <laughs> Justin Torres. Let's woo, go, woo. JT. Justin Torres. The other JT. The other JT. The so other one. There you have it. That's some good players there. That's some good so players. So let's let's um spit them. Let's free. spit them back. Shout out the podcast. Yeah, we again. got our high slot podcast player of the week, Jlar. Hockey, hockey, everything hockey. They're gonna give you Love lines, that. fucking news, everything, bro. It's lit. We got our mass appeal player of the week, Rocco. Mm-hmm. Mass appeal. Everything baby. mass. Boston sports. Yes, sir. We have our steel and Naz player of the week, Riley Lang. That's a big one right Four there. Four-time champ. Can he grab his fifth That's while being sponsored right there. by the Steel and Naz pod? Let's do it. Let's, Let's do go. It. And finally, Let's we have the it. Scramble <laughs> Podcast yes. sponsored player of the week is Justin Torres. Fire. That's huge, man. Uh, shout out to every single podcast that's out here, um, you know, giving their time and their efforts and their money and investing into the UDL players. You guys got to understand this is huge. We've never had a sponsored player. We've never had anyone sponsor the league. And you guys should feel like honored to be the first players to be sponsored. So hopefully you guys can put on for your your uh your team, you know, whatever teams on your to back. Represent. Yeah, we yeah gotta coming get, soon. I'll put it under the UDL coming, jersey. Coming soon. Coming Absolutely. soon. Maybe catch a W. You can, yeah, you can uh, get some merch. Shout out Clean and Souls. We'll just hit up Clean and Souls. He has a printing press in his backyard. We'll press them bitches next yeah, week. Let's, let's get, get it, it, man. Yeah. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and shout out Hedge Better again for being the mastermind behind all of this. Hedge uh, Better. Could not do it without Hedge Better. On the rise. Stock On the rise. Rising. To the moon. Yes, sir. Hedge Better. Yeah. UDL to the moon. Let's if you it. don't follow Hedge Better, Elon honestly, Musk waiting at the moon for us. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't, if you don't follow Hedge Better, yeah, it's insulting because yeah. we couldn't do this podcast right. without Hedge Better. If you're not please, already following please them, follow Hedge just go ahead and, yeah. and tune us. out real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Flip over to Instagram, go give them a follow, yeah. and then you can come back over. Yeah, and it's gonna it's gonna be part of the way for you to get into that huge giveaway that we're gonna be posting on our Instagram right. every single week. Our sponsored players. So you see how easy it is to play mm-hmm. a free UDL tourney now. They've made it as simple as yeah, ever. That's crazy. You just got to show a little bit of love to some great podcasts, and you'll be glad you did anyways. You don't. You shouldn't even need be a good free person. money to, uh, to follow a, these Just pods. be a good, good guy. Okay. Like, we need some good guys. Right. Good, good guy. You know, because, you know, just good guys, man. JT, let's get into your yes, award sir. predictions. You know we're headed oof, here. Oof, oof, I warned you about it before. I want your award predictions for 2022. Yeah, you gave me a day notice, and it was Still, still <laughs> hard to pick all, to pick all these awards with all the new rookies, all, new season, new vibes Stop. for every yeah, team, new absolutely. partners. Yeah, but what? Uh, we we'll start with MVP. Whatever you want, roll it down. MVP. I got. I think I got Jay Rich this year. Right? I, I love it. His partner, they, I like it. They love started it, like off it. hot and hot this tournament already, and he was definitely a MVP candidate last year. But he got de- he got Defensive Player of the Year, and so yep. he could have could have won both easily. Absolutely. Offensive Player of the Year. I like I like Nick. I I like him. I like. Let's him go. They yeah. they maybe yeah. like it's a little recent tournament bias how they already got the ship, but he's not. Yeah, it's a good it. pick. Or I got Alec too. He didn't get mm-hmm. to show out his first tournament, but check the stats from last year, man. He yeah. could have eased. Alex had, right there. That was a great pick. Definitely picks. my award, but. He definitely could. He's definitely right. in the running for it. Yeah. So. You gotta you gotta win and you gotta play games right. to even exactly. be in the conversation. So I mean, you gotta win great, to be great in You gotta win to be in these awards. And Nick already yes. has a win, too. so he's already yeah. stuff. Right. You gotta be competitive. It's tough like yes, sir. You're like like my boy our boy Beretti is the like a uh, top five in scoring last right. year and this year, but he hasn't caught the wins that he needed to be but, to get up. But there that's the thing, bit. like with last year, like we I mean we had the stats, we what well, we knew we kinda knew, but we they're not they weren't public. But like this year, yeah. like we know what they are, you know what I mean? So yep. I feel yeah. I feel like someone who doesn't win as much but has mo like a lot of points <laughs> to stats. back it up. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. I feel like they also should be deserve an opportunity well. to right. win too. No, absolutely. You know what I, you know what I JT, mean? JT Bain won a won a award last year, and um, JT Torres also won an award last year. Yes, they made 
appearances, but they didn't. Yeah, but like, you know, take like, it home, like so. I'm saying, like Alec, like Alec, Alec had the most points per exactly. game. You know what I mean? But mm-hmm. he wasn't in any right. of the talk of offensive player of the year. And you, you're right but there. Now, but now this year, we know we know the we know the mm-hmm. numbers. You know what I mean? That's so true. Last a lot year, of people, we picked, yeah, look at the wins, but that should be like an MVP race. Yeah, we didn't know the stats. Yeah, when we, we picked we, the awards. Right, I'm saying yeah. we, we didn't. Know, we didn't know stats. We didn't know exactly. We didn't film. Right, we weren't counting. You know, but I test just. You know, experience just knowing who who Wins, showed really, up, too. Yeah. winning right. games. That, is the I mean, that's that, yes. dude. That's yeah. what it comes down to. It, that it wins. Is yeah, what you it guys is. had the you second win. most points. Second last most year. wins. With the second most wins. Wins. But wins. The fifth seed though. Second most wins. So boom, like like Troy said, it was the wins that that really helped you too. It was yeah. It was coming out of the losers bracket a couple times. Yeah, so you have to win those extra two games. Right. But. I think the the tourney you did go to the finals and lost. I think you were like nine and two in that tourney. You're like eight and two because that was one of our bigger tourneys. Of the yeah, season, we came out of the winners bracket that tournament. Though. Oh, yeah. so it was one of the. Yeah. They had I think had like it was six. the one after that. Yeah, that you, were, we, you went final four. Yeah, I think we were final four. You played a lot. We of, lost you played, our first game and then rolled right. off like six in a row. A ton. That's the one when um Shazo was balling out, right? Yeah, tourney right? four. That was a tourney where you and Fabi and, and, and mm. Shay and Mark had a fucking crazy game. Yeah, they did. Crazy. You guys beat really. Rocco and and D Hall in that one of the best tilts of the season. Yeah, that was I think that was eleven to ten game. I they had you sure. down on the ropes like seven six, eight seven, yeah. nine eight, all all three of those scores. And every time you and Fabi would make those game saving diving snags. There was a lot of game saving a lot. snags there. Thanks. That's a tilt Tuesday. We have a lot of tilt Tuesday that I gotta start <laughs> getting going on because yeah. that, that that whole final series could be a tilt Tuesday. We got Cam series. yo, Cam and Jay and fucking Monday and, and Ty yeah. went to like Cam, Jay, first Ty, eleven yeah. first that OT was, game of the season. Game. Yeah. That was crazy. Monday's not gonna, dude, the whole not crowd like shifted ended, towards that game, and I think no, like no one was even playing on the other table because it was just kept going. <laughs> right, facts. The team that was up next was like, "Hold up, can we just finish right. this game?" Yeah. Real quick? I was yeah. low key upset because I had to record the other game. <laughs> I'm not gonna say whose game it was. Like, I want to record your game, bro. It's just that you know, there's so much going on over there. I wanted to watch. And I was it. looking on. I was like, I have to play the loser of this game. I was like, you kidding me, you kidding me, dude? <laughs> Both playing. All right, what's your what's your next yeah. award, JT? It's my next award. You got so MIP Rookie of the Year. Left. I got Depoy. I'm gonna, rock. I'm gonna rock with Colin. Nice. Definitely gonna rock with Colin. I love it. No nice. one said Colin yet. No one. I think especially like nice. maybe it's a little re, uh, recent tournament bias, but like he's all he, he was in it last to, year he too. Knows, he's yeah, always there. He knows he's how to, he knows there. how to get to yeah. a die, and he. Shows up most of the time besides the playoffs last year. Nah, that's a, that's <laughs> yeah. one of my favorite teams, honestly. I ain't going to lie. I was fucking yeah. with them when they first came. It's solid, so. Low key. Then what Someone got to get an award from that team at their, some point. Yeah, they're playing right? the Definitely. talking. So, Definitely. So, uh, rookie of the year, everyone's favorite's Cam. So, I got either Cam or my man uh, Roach. Ooh, oh, I like Roach. Go with Roach. Yeah. I like, yeah. He, he, go with the Roach. We already yeah, have enough Cam. Yeah. Make, it, make it interesting. Not, no offense, Cam, but we need some other names in nah, here he beat to make me it dicey. Fair and square. And like I said, that yeah. crazy toss he has, it comes across the table. Yeah. With the wind, like it's so hard to track. Facts. Right. And, yeah, and it's, probably it's like tough to it's defend. so unorthodox. You're looking, you're like, there's no way this is hitting the table consistently. You're no way this like kid's at, like actually and gonna it hits die. Every time. don't think he missed a single throw the entire. It's impressive. Game. I've never seen that toss ever, bro. Like yeah, you've seen, you've seen the overhands. Team, you've bro. seen like people throw close to the table, far from the table, at an angle, but you've never seen a motherfucker. <laughs> I'm fucking hook that shit. Like, yeah, no, that's like crazy. Kareem, yeah. yeah. So, and then I think I got my most improved. I want to say Schmerder. I know you can't win awards because. You can't say my name. I like that shout out. I like that shout out. Yeah, you can't say my name. I know, but if you could win awards, I would definitely have you up there. I I appreciate it, brother. That's love. I appreciate it, brother. I'm going to rock with my man Beretti. He's yeah. now that now that he's got the stuff. He was in the contention last year, but now he's got the stats and everyone can show. I mean, everyone can see like. How just how good he is on the yeah, offensive again, end. Low key. Another, another award where the stats will prove on who actually exactly. is. Stats will really help offensive players. You know what I mean? I don't want to say fuck the stats, but games, yo, man. other than like, like other not to just, hype up Beretti's stats. Point of view. You yo, know but Reddy I mean? has gotten so much better at die. Like right. general, when he yeah. first came to our backyard, I'm not like he's played die before, but I'm not sure if he knew all the rules. I'm not sure if he was like that familiar with the way we play die. Yeah, he never but went to any Bridgewater tournaments. That's or what I'm saying. Like that. So full 55 Main Street. No. Nah, 544. Nah. 544. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dyslexia. Yeah, dyslexia. Yeah. But like I was saying, like, yo, that dude, honestly, like even when we play in the backyard now, he's just way like smoother and, and natural with the game. 
it comes to them a lot easier. I feel like it's repetition. Yeah. And once yeah. your body kind of like learns how to like react and move and like yeah. you start doing shit without even thinking about it. That's yeah. when you start really. And really the, fir really the first turn is always tough. That mini tournament. That's yeah, what I'm saying. Saturday, but Brady was going. Ahead. Brady was going crazy, man. You know, the first turn is always tough. Yeah, I mean, mid -se always. mid season is. I mean, you'll actually see who's. Jumping ahead and exactly. who's not jumping ahead? You mid season, know I mean? how after three yeah. tourneys, bro, it's yeah, gonna start that, getting. That's what, that's what I'm saying. Get you know scared I mean? if you people haven't gotten a point. At the top right. will start making their moves. I think exactly. After the second or you third know, tournament. people start putting who's their foot to, down. Yeah. And, who's supposed you know, to be there? And stuff. You see who's dominating and who's dominating with them mm -hmm. versus. It's who like in any sport, you're doing good and isn't. Now you know who all the teams are. You're not sleeping on any more rookies. Exactly. Like people have already proved themselves, so you're not taking any game lightly. Exactly. Absolutely. You look at it's, the Nats. The league know. just keeps getting better and better. Every turning. I love it. Literally every turning. Chuck them. Love it. See ya. <laughs> oh. Peace, Nats. See ya. That's a clean sweep. Jason yeah. Tatum's the best player Jason in the NBA. Jason Tatum. He's definitely the best player on that court. If we, were saying, we were saying Kevin Durant was the best player in the NBA. So now that he just shitted on Kevin Durant, I'm going to say Jason Tatum's the best player in the NBA, right? That's what we're doing, right? I think that's what we got to say. Fair. Fuck it. That's fair. <laughs> Until he's number zero for a reason. He's he's better than the number one. He, right. he comes before number one. Zero people are better than him. <laughs> <laughs> Legit. Facts, bro. Hey, I got my laptop here for a reason. I was just about to say, what do you got over there, Troy? Me, I know uh, you got some stats. I got something. Stats. Stats. I got yeah. stats. Everything. You know I got the stats. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to, I'm like looking at it. I don't even know what I'm reading. I got, <laughs> we got to call some people out. We got to give some people praise. Absolutely. We got to get put people on some notice. We'll do all of that right now. Let's call yeah. people out. Let's call so, people out. Yeah, let's start. Let's I like talking my shit. Let's start with some, let's start with some praise. Points per game leaders. Yeah. Who led. The, who led in scoring per game on average? Uh, in the number five spot, it is Roach, rookie Roach. That was JT Boom. Baines, rookie right. of the year. Pick already right already, right. On, okay. already top on five par. in scoring. So, so shout out Roach. Yeah. So my picks looking good already. Looking yeah. Good. And how about your other two picks? Uh, tied for third, J Rich and Beretti, both there at three points per game. I'm telling you, man, stats don't lie. And you didn't even see these right. stats. I didn't. Yeah, this no, is, I haven't. Yeah, this is news to you right now. But apparently, JT is a fucking A1 day one scout. Like, right. <laughs> if nice. he was a Madden scout, it'd be an A+. Plus. You would grab him for your, your my team, whatever you I, call I, that I shit. I tossed a few dies in my day, you know? <laughs> <laughs> you guys ready for number two? B-Gar. Brendan Garrity. Shout out, Brendan. Brendan Garrity. You... Shout out all the Brendans out there. Shout out, B-Gar. B-Gar oh, yeah. won yeah. both of their games in the little rookie tournament. They yeah. made it in. And then they balled. They beat D. Hall and Kearney. Too. He plunked. They beat D. Hall and Kearney. They beat a couple other good teams. They had. They finished uh, three and three and two on the day. Played good against Linga and Rich. Played crazy played great against, against you. You were good shook. against Linga and Rich. You saw it in the mic up. Yeah. You were genuinely like nervous mm -hmm. a little uh, yeah. bit. Yeah, I mean, uh, you were down I, 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 I tend not to get nervous. I mean, there was nothing nervous it's about a game it. Around. It was respect. You know, it was just respect. It was on three that, on, that, on that table. It was three zero. I, I was... mean, whatever. I mean, Jarvis just had to hit a couple cuffs and we're ready to <laughs> get, 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 get a little wet. And get your splash guard. Yeah. A couple plunks. You understand? Get your ponchos, motherfucker. Get your uh, umbrella. <laughs> <laughs> Number one in scoring in the league after the first tourney, John Commande. Wow. 3.5 points per game. Holy. He, which he would, if he wow. kept 3.5, he, he needs a bounce back here. He does. We were talking about he this. Does. He, needs, he needs a bounce back He's due for back a big year. He could be an MIP too, man. Absolutely. For sure. John yeah. Commande. Yes, sir. Yeah, we need a little more five. volume from him, though. We need a little, yep. a little more volume cut and right. some tournament games, get some finals. Because he's yeah. – him and Ty are – him and Ty, Ty are, so good. They are, bro. They're one of the great teams that haven't – Does Ty drop, Die. Ty doesn't drop. Yet. Does he fucking bro, drop he it? He doesn't drop. I don't think he ever drops it. And he, and he catches it, like, in the most awkwardest position. He, always, he always catches it in the weirdest yeah. spot at the last right. second. Like yeah. It's his... like, Ty, how the – Fuck did yeah, you catch it's that? But, but, but then again, he looks across the table at Commande. It's like, how the fuck did you catch that too, dude? <laughs> yeah, that, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Smacks, that. smacks it into the ground. Give me that. You know, they're, they're they're spectacular, dude. dude. I, I caught one of my FIFAs like that last tourney, and I was like, I like looked for Commande. I'm like, you proud? You proud? Like, <laughs> you I'm like, I me? did, bro. I did it. You see me? <laughs> I'll tell you who led the tourney in. Led the tourney, sorry, in FIFA's kicked. There was three guys that had nine. Oof. Three guys already started the year with nine FIFAs. Wow. And to put it into perspective, last season, my partner Marani led the seat, led the uh, 
led the league in FIFA's with yeah. 20 on the year. 20. Yeah. Which yeah. is a lot. 20, I thought that was a nine. lot. I know. There's already nine. Yeah, Jesus. don't that's crazy, but there is more there is gonna be there is more games this year. So I feel like stats will be a little at but the after end of the one total, turning, but after one turning, no, that's unheard yeah. of. That's absolutely right. unheard of. The only thing I can of. chalk it up to is the wind and how crazy windy yeah. it was, and people really yeah. couldn't find table. So yeah. the thieves were up. Yeah, the FIFA opportunities were there, but it's still hard to FIFA. Still hard to FIFA, FIFA right? FIFA when complete you don't know the where FIFA it's coming like, down to. Yeah, like, man, like, like, muddy ass like, floor. You got to run to the FIFA. People's stats for missed table are probably all just oh, through yeah. the roof right Self now. Self points are up. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> yeah, know? there's no missed table stat, but hang your side, same side. Right. Self point, yeah. Any yeah. self point, whether it's right. FIFA toss or same FIFA side, tough, yeah. yeah. But the three guys that do have true nine that, true. are Rocco, not to be, not to be uh, surprised right there. Hell no, Torres, who actually right. that shit is out. crazy. Justin yeah. Torres with nine. He at least six. had five fevers against me. Them Jordan ones. He must. He better wear those <laughs> the rest he of the was, years. Yeah. Well, he was he was here last week, and he and he even knew. He's like, dude, that's all I did. Right. Yeah, like, I kicked everything. That shit was popping did. up in the sky. Pop right. flies, and bro. And Kevin's got range, too. Yeah. So he's getting and, right. I mean, he got yeah. a six yeah. foot two, yeah. dude. You can see their strategy. Torres just puts it up in and, the air as Kev, high as he possibly can. And, and he knows it. that Kevin's going to get he's there. Kevin just, just gets under it. that he bitch. He just gives him enough time. Mm -hmm. That That's a great team. They've been playing well. Nah, they were they were another team that when you first saw them at attorney, maybe like you're looking at them like, oh, all right, they're all right. But right. now you're like, yo, they're good. Right. They are good. They're good. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Great team. Both came a long way. Shout out, shout out Danelle and fucking JT, man. And finally, with nine as well, is rookie Jay Davern. Oh, Jason shit. Jason Davern at Cam, nine. Boom. That's Cam, Cam Green's Cam partner. Yeah, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. Fed Cam He's all He's kicking game the shit out of him. I didn't, I didn't see many play. of their games, but uh, uh, he I was heard money. They yeah, were, yeah. Like Cam I, loves the baseball slide to, yeah, to yeah, the catch. Yeah, 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 it's yeah, smooth, yeah. too. Yeah. yeah. That's the thing. I didn't fire. see that many games either, but I heard all their games. Right. <laughs> right. Well, that's what I'm saying. Anything. Yeah, I heard that them all. That team was electric. I yeah. Him and I don't know how much of it was Jay, but Cam at least was so vocal and that, that we see it. We that see that it energy in the tape. was so awesome. We see it yeah, in the that's tape. Wins you some games sometimes. It does. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta. You gotta play when you can hype up your teammate too like that. No, it facts. inspires them. Good vibes and everything. Get the crowd into it. Get the crowd on your side when you're that when you're that vocal and that energized. Fuck yeah. Okay. Absolutely. I love it. You gotta be loud. You know, <laughs> loud and proud. Yeah. The quiet teams. I mean, though they're sneaky, they're not getting in your head. You know what I mean? No. Exactly. The teams that are yelling yeah, and getting all right. animated that yeah, I'm like, oh, exactly. shit, this team's really like in it to win. You got to throw a mean mug in there too. Gotta. I mean, if you're That's not on the other side, when of you table score on somebody, shit. fucking like, yeah. Yeah. right, like, fucking go growl at, go go fucking push them. <laughs> <laughs> nah, don't push them. <laughs> Hold on, what are you? Side of the table, just throw a shot. Yeah, <laughs> Torres, I see you right now on Instagram Live saying, "Rest in peace, Jay." His meniscus is that. Is that something that mean? really happened? I, I hope you guys are We're lying. not taking his word for it. He's hating. Well, I, I saw it from, I saw it from Jay, Jay Rich said, rest in peace, Jay, too. So hopefully uh, no hopefully way. Jay's Which all Jay? good. Jay Rob Jay Davin, back in we're three weeks about. with a torn meniscus. Facts. So, He's going to be here in a fucking knee brace biz. like Gronkowski, yeah. but not on Damn. his elbow. I don't know what you guys are talking about, but I hope it's not Jay's Hey, meniscus. we wish you the the um the best, though, man, if, if that's true. Yeah, absolutely. Prayers up. Absolutely, man. Wow! Yeah, that's some big he's news. That's big news. He's pulling out lag. There's no wow. lag. It's official. They no. said they said he tore it in a money game after the tournament. Really? Wow! Yes. Prayers up to Jay. Yo, Jay. I, honestly, wow. I, I appreciate you for um for grinding though. Wow. You you had a great you had a great Damn. tourney, and we know when you come back, you're gonna you're gonna be that guy. So it's a long season. Hopefully, he yeah. can de definitely come back. Yeah. Once again. Like I said, there's so many such a long season. So many. We play games. until he's, September. He right. still has. Like, right. It you got come months. Back. Yeah. You know yeah. What I mean, yeah. Just don't be stupid and <laughs> think you got it and you don't. Yeah. Because that's definitely heal gets, up before you come back. Worse. Yeah. If you right. feel good, man, you're always welcome. Cause straight baller. Word. Yeah. Thank you, Jay Rich, Torres, Zill for the for the update. Yeah. Shout out the boys, man. Instagram live. If you guys aren't on the Instagram live weekly, um, you should just tune in on Tuesdays because our podcasts aren't posted when we do them but you guys can watch them live on instagram live so it's cool tuesday night 8 if you really love the podcast and you want some insight before it drops get on that instagram live drop some questions yeah, you know, interact talk with to us, us a little bit yeah so it's a vibe man talk, talk that talk, shit talk that shit a little talk bit that shit. so number four <laughs> in fiefs was langa with seven 
So there you go. You had seven. Let's yeah. go, Lang. That, fir- that first game I had, I think I had like four, at least four, four. or five of them. Yeah. Another thing, bro, it's the shoes with the fat soles. You it, had right. Air Force black Ones Air Force, on. The black Air I wore the Force wrong that, shoes. Right. Really? Being f- but that's, I always wear. Fabi was, I think, was third in the league last year. FIFA was maybe second. And we he didn't have Converse. We didn't have a single FIFA. You had while. zero. We on had the day. zero on the no, day. No, Fabi needs to bring his Vans back out. Right. Unlike us, which is crazy. He wears the Vans. Vans are nice for FIFA too. They got that nice little um sole. Nice sole to like. Pop that shit up, dude. I get I have dirt on my black converse from like two years ago. <laughs> it, I I only wear them when I play die. Bring oh, I have, out. bro. I, I always I, only, the, oh, oh, you wear them every time. Yeah, no. I have to. And only one. It's weird. Only my FIFA leg, which is my <laughs> right leg, is the shoes tied. The left shoe, <laughs> loose. <Never. laughs> How the fuck do you play with one tight shoe I, and one loose shoe? Because I, I don't. I don't use. I don't kick. I'll That's never so kick with weird, the other one, bro. Hmm. It's crazy. I, I need know. to have my socks the same height. Like, I can't have my <laughs> fucking shoe tight and the other one loose. What's wrong with you? I don't know. My man's playing lob side. I feel bad for your left ankle. That boy is taking damage. Hey, it works. <laughs> it works. <laughs> no, I ain't trying to knock on wood. <laughs> I'll wrap up the Fevis kick top five. It was Steve Fennell. Wow, Fennell. that's surprising. He had Fennell and them. Roach, both coming in two different top fives. That team is hot right yeah, now. It's a hot team. Man. Um, Jay Rich wants to hear self points. I don't know. Are we? Are we oh yeah, shade? self points, bro. I don't know about that one, Jay Rich. <laughs> Jay Rich asks for it. <laughs> let's, let uh, let's let a couple weeks go by. <laughs> yeah, light them off. Wind was a factor, but all right. I don't have. Oh, I do have self same time per game. All right, here we go. I did every oh, per game on there. Um, <laughs> boys, this isn't. This is just something to improve. This does, this isn't uh you can't be mad at it. It's this just, isn't anything yeah. that you can't improve. But in with the most same sides after one tourney per game, it was Kevin Mood. It was Kevin Mood, but they did pick up a win. He played nice defense, so shout out Mood. Yes, sir. You get that toss better. You guys are gonna be sneaky. Like Troy said, we're telling nice. you guys the top same size just so you guys can know next tourney clean it up, and um that's gonna help you score more points because the less same size you give the other team, it's probably gonna end up on the other side of the table. And Kev's an athlete; he's gonna figure it out. Absolutely. Exactly, he was. Yeah, he, he'll figure it out. I can't wait to hear these next two. The second most same Are size you this? points per game was Kearney for this tourney. Owen Kearney. Yeah, I think the host was a little stressed out hosting, so we could give him a break there. Maybe he was no, uh, no breaks. <laughs> <laughs> All gas, damn. Maybe he was. Um, damn. We're throwing shade. We're throwing shade. <laughs> damn, new, son. Where did you find this? First, when first <laughs> new partner, damn, first turn, first turn the, the okay. weather. Third is Zill. Ah man, Zill. But <laughs> Zill was carrying a big scoring load for his team, so we'll give him credit there because he was scoring a lot. Yeah, yeah. Uh, he did have, and it was only four same sides. Like it's not like he was throwing a lot. That's he nothing, threw four no. in four games. That's, that's, one not, game. that's one a game. game. That's not, nothing, man. That's not bad at all. No. Um, fourth. Then we just got um, Nick Knapp at four. Yeah, he played a ton of games. Played too, a ton so of games. That's he, quantity. Yep. He only and he only threw six in seven games. And then Jake, Jake at point six seven. He threw two. Point six two. We don't even have to three. fucking yeah. say that. One. You know what I mean? He threw two and three. <laughs> it's so not even one. It wasn't. Right. It wasn't as bad as it could have been. I yeah. think FIFA tosses would have got worse. I won't even go into FIFA tosses. Nah, we even, don't need that skewed. I didn't even grab the average because yeah, FIFA tosses is truly That's super skewed. skewed. The wind. Hell yeah. yeah. Even yeah. the same size is skewed, so we and don't I'll, know. I'll, I'll finish off stats on a good note with plunks. We had seven plunks on the tourney. Woo woo. That's for the tough. for the first time, I think that's that the most tough. we've ever had in a tourney. It's easily got to be. Hell we had a yeah. lot. Of, think about all these plunk records we, we had. had. Like we had most plunks in a tourney. Last year. I know. We had most plunks in a game by one team, which was Langa and Jay Rich plunking twice in one game. That's never happened. Nope. Mm, I don't think ever. so. I th- no? actually, you guys did it last season, but it was both bounce plunks against Nick against the same exact team. Yeah. No, sorry, it was against Nick and Colin last time. You bounce plunked. You each bounce plunked okay. to beat them. Yeah, but this time it was two flush plunks. Mm-hmm. Me and Jerry the same the GWP game. babies. It was a big, <laughs> and they, it was a big game too because yeah. that was the one you were down three zero. Needed it. Give me it. Needed it. Um, so you had two plunks on the tourney. Pat had two plunks on the tourney. That was that electric rookie that was running yeah, around huge, doing man. the clapping clap push ups. Yeah, 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 yeah. Honestly, I want to give a shout out to um, to Pat shit. and Joe because. Those dudes were monster drinkers, and we love drinkers because <laughs> love them. It just adds energy to the tourney. Like we could just That's tell why we're here. You feel exactly. good on it's that a table, Saturday. and I can tell you are uh, you are Saturday's putting your, with your boys, your emotions into for? that game, and it's just so much more entertaining. Shout out those guys, and they know how to hold their booze too, because 
they played great in the entire time. Played so. a lot of games too. And they got, that beers add up. They low key got <laughs> taking advantage up. of being rookies, not even on anyone's fault that they just didn't know the rules as much. So they were dropping biz all the time. They were saying, "Yeah, it was five, a biz five, thing." Oh, they, yeah, they were drinking. There was a game. They, <laughs> yeah, it was a biz thing. They got, I was trying to tell they got biz they three times drinking. in one game, yeah, bro. and then two times in another game. Yeah. So five times within two games. They yeah. win that game. They won both. Yes. Wow. Those dudes were drinking. <laughs> hey, listen, That's adversity right yeah. there. They got biz three times against us. They were also down three. Oh, and they won that game. Yeah. Wow, like that dude. dude. I mean, that team. And they won, the, and it wasn't like they, they got replenished them. <laughs> like, yo, bro, it wasn't like the the business were one after another. It was like business to start the game, business in the middle of the game, yeah. biz at like near game, like game. Finale, point. Finale was banging them on biz. Yeah, he was. Oh, he had them. That dude. was a different game too. Uh, yeah, yeah, he exactly. had them just spitting out biz. They must have. They must have. They did tighten it up. Yeah. Because <laughs> after that, I saw them talking to each yeah. other like, "Yo, yo we are not they're like, they're like, fucking fuck saying that shit." Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're not don't saying talk. that number. Best way to learn is failure. You know? right. Yeah. Yeah. JT physical. taught me the hard way in my own backyard. Oh, I yo, used to be the yo, Smurda, how tall are you? Yeah. Five eleven, biz. Right. <laughs> yo, yo, what? Oh, what's the what's address? address? Right. What's the address so I could tell so and so to come over? Five four four Main Street, biz. Right. I got your phone number. What is it? Right. Every, every which way you get someone biz. to drink a beer. Hey, it works. You gotta. I mean, that's all part of the game. Yeah. You know. It's all about, you know, getting that one up. You just want to get a little bit of advantage. And the thing is, you once you're a vet, you're never falling for any of those tricks yeah. ever again. So how like, tall once you? Get are you? Of, yeah, you're not. Um, I'm you tall, got, bitch. Like, like, how much do you weigh? I weigh 400 pounds. <laughs> yeah, you know like, what I mean? I don't yeah. even got to talk to you. You learn not to even answer yeah. questions like that. Exactly. Right. Like, exactly. You don't care about me. You don't care yeah. about that answer. Like, you, just wanna, you just want me to drink. Yeah. So um, <laughs> is that the last That's two guys with two guys with two plunks. That's Langer and Pat. Langer and Pat. Which is crazy because we had two guys leading the league with two plunks last season. So yeah. we're already like at the same spot yeah, we, we were with plunks at the end of last season. But then but then again, you got to think of it. Next tourney, there could be zero plunks, right? Yep. You know right. what I mean? It could 100%. stay at it could stay at two for two tourneys. You stay at two I for mean? the rest of the year. Right. It's a fucking plunk. You know what I mean? Right. Nobody even aims for plunks. Like the plunk, when the plunk happens, I mean, maybe you aim for the plunk, but most of the time it's just like oh, yeah. just perfect Dude, toss, what if, what if, clap right what, in your cup. What about in the, in the in uh what uh, was was it the the recap video when I plunked Colin? <laughs> I, I was like. Yeah, and you just and I just went right in, dude. I was just dying. You, you can I see was it. Just you like, in. You know what's the worst and then part? Jay Rich throws his. I go, there it is. Yep. <laughs> Yo, when that shit gets thrown at you, do you notice that it's just I see it and I'm the like, whole fuck. way? Yeah, the whole way you're looking dude, like. Hopefully, I'll it just drops move my cup and take yeah, the point. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, actually, I'm actually thirsty right now. <laughs> I'd be fucked. Be like, yo, 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 no, that's a punk game. Anyway. I wouldn't even know what to do. I'd be like, yo, game over. You yeah. lost. Yeah, fuck yeah. you, that's You can't do that. You just lost the game. Because <laughs> those are the Actually. best plays, man. Yeah, yeah three awesome. other guys did have one plunk as well. And also, not one bounce plunk on the day. Seven yeah. straight flash plunks. I noticed plunks. that, too. Splash, I noticed, splash, I noticed splash, splash. that, too. Yeah. So we had Fennel with a plunk. Water. We had Bigar with a plunk. And we had Jay Rich with a plunk. So a lot of the Chula. same names we've been Nani. saying. Like, these are the... These are a similar theme of names we've mm-hmm. been saying. These guys have been playing well. Yeah, yeah man. Hey, to get far in the tourney, you're going to have to have plays like you gotta Punks, win. FIFA's, scoring fucking four points in one game. You got to have those. Because how, how else are you beating all these good teams if you're not showing out? All right. So, yeah, man. So, uh, what are we looking like for next time, man? How do you got you got a a number of teams that we're getting that we it's got? It's gonna be bigger. Right now? It'll be bigger. It's definitely. Um, I was shocked 100%. that there was only eighteen teams. Yeah, and the but first was, one. people couldn't make it. It was it's Easter week. You know what I mean? It was that's, Easter weekend. Yeah, that's yeah. very that's, true. That it was fact. Easter yeah. for most people. This yeah. one, I I can't tell you for sure exactly how many, but twenty four. I want to say. Yeah, definitely. around there. Now that we won't yeah. have that rookie uh, round robin to get right. straight yeah. into yeah. the tournament, yeah. we won't have to do that. Yeah. And we'll another just... thing, yo, my birthday is actually uh, Thursday. Uh, you know, so shit. we're April babies and we're not fools. We did the tourney the same <laughs> weekend as my fucking yeah, we birthday. Know what we're doing. Saturday scholars. If you don't have any plans, I've already told you last week, so please don't have any plans. I was trying to tell you guys to keep your schedule a little open after the tourney. Scholars, we're going up. Uh, UDL birthday Shmurda Bash. Absolutely, you can't miss it. If you're co- if you're pulling up to the turn, you better have a great excuse as now. to why you can't. Pull this up is and my drink quarter of a century, man. It's a big one. This is humongous. Oh, we got the weather Saturday. Great great weather. Weather. We're looking at great weather. Every every day, partly is a great cloudy. Day to play die, you right. know. But. Yep. 
What we, up? we don't all know how this iPhone app what is. Yeah. Kind of, you, you, yeah. We are looking great. We got 55 for a high. Looking great. Yeah, it's supposed to be 20. nice. I like it. Uh, yeah, big Schmerta bash after the tourney. Bang make sure up. to pull up. Make sure to stick around. Maybe go get home and shower Get ready for the tequila and green tea it. shots. Um, get ready for me to be dancing with my shirt unbuttoned for no damn reason because it's probably too hot in there. You know what I'm saying? Nelly style is getting too hot in here. Phones in pockets. <laughs> yeah, he's not going to do that again. <laughs> Keeping the phone in my skinny jeans so I don't break it in the middle of the street and bust Death it. Grip that thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. So um, I, love it. I feel like uh, this tourney, though, is going to be even better than the last one 100%. because with the way we set the tone, it's only going to go up. So right. guys, I please show out. If you said you was going to come, please make it. If you if you can't come for any reason, please give, please give us a... a like a 24 hour notice so we can be like okay like this team's not coming let's let's hit up another team to replace them and try to like cuz we can always the finesse right. and sometimes yeah. we reach out to people who might not have the attorney in mind right. and then they end up just coming anyway right. because we say hey yo so and so um is is it going to be here can you just please come cuz right. we need an extra team and like <laughs> just give us a heads up even if you're going to be late you know, even yeah. if you're yeah. going to be late, so we're not blowing you up at 12 o'clock. Where the fuck are you? Where the fuck are you? Where the yeah. fuck are you? Yeah, we guys just, up at 12. Yeah. Let's go. We, we need to put our foot yeah. down on that a little right. bit. We're all, we're all grown men here. If you Boom. can't wake up and get to a house by noon. Exactly. You're, you're for the birds. <laughs> you're for the <laughs> wake birds. Up, wake up on Sunday. We're chirping. You're for the birds. Yeah. Come, uh, let us know, at least with it before. Right. 24 hours. We're, we're, we're all nice people. Just yeah. tell us that you're going to be there. Just Some so I us. know. And, and don't just show up and expecting to play because then it puts us in a little pickle. Yeah. We just want to, when we get to the yard, we kind of just want to get the dies in the air and, you know, like start recording, get the mics on people if we're doing a mic dub. It, it, it's never about um, adding teams during the turn. We always want to like just go boom, like lights yeah. blazing. We right. Everyone's here. Let's start it. Let's get it. We're picking the fucking hat right now and we're going to get this board we filled up. We have the tournament and, bracket and made already mm -hmm. with the amount of teams that we were prepared for. But all good. It's all learning curve. Uh, I feel like next That's what I'm saying. It's only going to get better. Yeah. We made a work. We made it work. We pulled it off. Guys, yeah, shout out, shout out to Kearney for hosting the tourney. Um, yeah, that was a huge. huge that was Kearney. huge. We, we had nowhere else to play. Shout out Kearney. Yeah, thanks a lot to Mrs. Thank Kearney you, as well. Yep. Thank very, you to your, your, um, your mom. She was um, she was great. So, JT, any last words before we sign off? Uh no, guys. Um, thank you for having me on the podcast, yeah. dude. Had a blast. I'm just ready for Saturday. Absolutely, big weekend, <laughs> big weekend, <laughs> fellas. Absolutely, hundred percent. Lang, I know you're coming back for revenge. Absolutely, you know me. I ain't, I ain't going. So, Lang, else. you're not going to Fort Lauderdale. You told me you're going to Fort Lauderdale no, a couple weeks going. ago. No, I can't make it. Oh. I gotta, die. I gotta play some die. <laughs> got some, I got some money to win, not some money to spend. A lot of money. If we're talking twenty four teams, I'll Ooh, take that. Twenty five a team. Absolutely. I'll take that. Yes, sir. I love the twenty five a team. Yeah. Hey, that's gonna. <laughs> and mine's free. That's gonna. I gotta, yo, go, I gotta go represent. Oh, it's gonna make yeah, scholars yeah. easy, huh? It's gonna make scholars easy for you. Hey, listen, <laughs> scholars on me if I win. Scholars, <laughs> baby, let's go. Hey, scholars on Lang if he wins. You heard? I'm getting a shot you from Lang. Just gonna let so, yeah. <laughs> shout out, uh, shout out Hedge Better again. Thank you, Hedge Better, for shout everything they Hedge do. Better. This this podcast would not be possible without them. So yes, sir. again, make sure you're following them on all platforms. And congratulations to our sponsored players of the week, uh, brought to you by yep. Hedge Better. So those four guys will be playing attorney for free, first huge, time ever. Huge. Uh, their tourney will be paid for them and by these four podcasts. We'll notify you guys, obviously, um, before the tourney to uh, let you let you guys know who you're sponsored by. And um, oh, you you'll know. see. There, I'll, I'll be making graphics with with your just in case your they don't see the podcast. You'll have your you. picture on there, so you'll know that you're you're the stealing Naz player, of the day linger. You'll, yeah. you'll know. Ready to represent. Let's do it. Let's go. All right, everybody. Um, next week we'll be back with. Uh, not sure who our guests are going to be yet, but you know it's going to be another banger episode. Yeah, and we'll guess, have some new stats for you. Hopefully, a new, hopefully a new champion, maybe one of us here at this table. That'd be nice. Facts, Facts man. Um, I would, yeah, I would love nothing more. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> yo, there. I don't want to say hopefully it's one of us at this table. Hopefully it's anyone but Langa. <laughs> I would love <laughs> because more. yo, like yo, fuck Langa. Yeah. Nah, I love you, Langa. <laughs> All right, everybody. Thank you. Have a good one. Shout out, yes, sir.